last leg of my trip in Colombia today. I'm heading to Cartagena and I am beyond excited. It's been a, a dream really for me to go there and um, I'm boarding soon. I'm like so happy. So day very sunny and it's uh, it, it's gonna stay like that for the rest of the weekend and then I'm um, going back to Quito Ecuador on Monday and start working okay so <laughs> okay well ready you know and oh with my sombrero I mean you know am I not Colombian right now <laughs> okay. It is so hot. Like, it must be at least like 35 degrees or something. I'll check a bit later, but it's ridiculously hot. And um, I have my tour guide here, and I don't know people are trying to sell this stuff. Um, but yeah, I haven't Hello. even got Hola, there yet. <laughs> I made it. <laughs> Entiendo que no quieras de mi lado, pero por favor escúchame, yo necesito hablar. Entiendo que en tu vida fui un error, sé que solo fui la. 
So I haven't been to the water yet. Um, I managed to have a. I actually had the, the, the most mm, interesting massage. <laughs> It was nice actually, no sorry, it was very nice and um, and I couldn't decide between two dishes but I definitely wanted to try the the traditional one which is more of a fish thank you fish, coconut, uh, rice and uh, a salad and plantains but then uh, I, def I really wanted the shrimp, so uh, I went ahead and ordered an extra uh, plate of shrimp. The mojito is so strong. I mean, like I had to stop halfway because, um, yo, okay, later. <laughs> to this um, party bus um, <laughs> it's a party bus and we're going to like hop you know around the city you know like music dancing drinking on the bus meeting like amazing people so yeah it's gonna be fun <laughs> Let all of my dogs out Throw me up and I'm sick of hot summer Grammy Savage, that's what we are Grammy Shooters, just in G-Star GS9, I go so hard Wow, 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 wow. Oh, <laughs> 
Buenos dias. <laughs> and I had to do it. So, um, second day in um, Cartagena. And I am um, just waiting at um, the reception here for um, a tour bus. We're going to, um, to see this mud um, volcano I kept hearing about. It's, um, it's not like a real volcano, it's more like man-made clay mud puddle something. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's supposed to be a great one but the most um, uh, excited I am is, is to go see the pink sea uh, which I hope uh, will be pink because you know based on the, the time of the year sometimes um, the, the, the salt uh, content is not um, strong enough to really reflect that color so um, yeah I'm looking forward to it um it'll be late i'm just i'm so hungry i just had like a little breakfast i just hope i can um stop somewhere and like grab a chow or something and get going oh look look out the um this is it looks like a hotel reception but it's actually a um apartment building um very very nice i've posted a, a, a tour in my um uh, igtv uh, i'll probably record a bit more here as well i've survived the party bus guys it was insane like the <laughs> yeah I, I I don't know. Like I think body bus is like very Latin or something. I've never even seen that in in South Africa or any like African country I've been to. Uh, but it was I mean it was fun. The vibe, the amount of people, the music, the dancing. We really got to let loose and like hop at the same time in, in a few landmarks of the city. So it wasn't like all fun. And um, did stop by like. Um, a club as well which is very good and um yeah it's nice you know i really got a like a good sense of the nightlife um here so great adventure <laughs> I just finished with <laughs> the mud bath. I don't think the this mud is gonna be completely off for another. <laughs> I don't know how long the smell is crazy um, I couldn't take my camera with um, but I've got some nice pictures on the phone I'll just like take a few shots to show you the whole like setup <laughs> it is, it's pretty funny so what happens is first you need to go change into this house and they have you um, you know, you leave your, your stuff, nobody is stealing it or anything, and then um, no shoes or whatever, but you can keep your, your sandals. I kept mine because the stairs were pretty hot. I wanted to be comfortable. Um, so then you're up on your way. Uh, you then climb up the mountain over there. Um, uh, wait, I'll take a... A uh, better video from this side. Okay, and then you like going up to the mud puddle, and then um, you spend a maximum of 20 minutes. And then uh, you can get a massage in there if you want, but um, yeah, I didn't. I just felt a bit invasive and then uh so i said no and then you just walk down you must know that there's a tip for every single thing that you do 
and uh, hello hey, ladies hi, hi. <laughs> how is it and then uh, now um, you, you go down and then walk all the way to to this river over there to, to wash down all the mud it's literally like lady, old ladies mamas um, washing you with like all the pressure of like life you know um, I don't know I can't attest about how clean the, <laughs> the water is really but um, yeah you, I mean you need it anyway to, to wash off the, the, the clay uh, mud thing and then um, so it's over there let me just uh, and then you back uh, they have a, like a shower that you can further sort of clean up and you change and then you on your way I got a watermelon for my troubles <laughs> so I'll just take a few pictures and then that's it that's the Totumo um, volcano experience for you um, again this is not like medicinal or anything uh, your skin is like sort of glow um, smoother you know obviously with clay but you know don't expect to be like you know your new self you know we're born from ashes or anything like that. no it's not happening um, <laughs> forget it <laughs> And um, it's a man-made um, um, volcano, so it's not a volcano. So just you won't. <laughs>